welcome back to your Feel Good Show. It's the midday broadcast of Expresso. Thank you very much for joining us. We're talking events, we're talking uh, weddings, celebrations, all of which warrant, of course, having something sweet at the end. And the question, do you have a sweet tooth? Well, of course you do. Uh, then you must love your desserts. And today is National Dessert Day, can you believe it? And we have the perfect way to celebrate it. Joining us is self-taught baker and owner of the stylish baker, Faiza Omar. And she'll be sharing her recipe from or for a tiramisu cheesecake for her new uh, from her new cookbook my sweet life that is launching on the 21st of october and i wanted to start the segment by quoting this or reading this excerpt from your book which i found quite lovely which is happiness is baking cookies mm -hmm. happiness is giving them away and serving them and eating them and talking about them reading and writing about them thinking about them and sharing them with you oh, that is just it just i think perfectly summarizes yeah. the delight that you will find uh, between these covers and you must be so proud of this Faiza. Oh yeah, it was quite an achievement, something that I really wanted to do for many years and I'm glad that I finally got to do it. I love that you just really enjoy sharing these experiences and this magic that you create in the kitchen with everybody else and yeah. for me, I'm really just here for you to share what you're about to make. Yeah, so I think that. it's great to um, share in the goodness. Yeah, absolutely. Because Before we start, because you've travelled quite a bit. Mm. Yes. Um, um, all over the world. I used to travel. You um, used to travel yeah. pre-lockdown, of, of course. Past. How many countries have you been to? Um, I don't know, I haven't counted, but I Ooh. know where Lost I want to go. Yeah. Fair to say you've stamped more than two passports, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, oh, great. Wow. Mm -hmm. The question I have for you is, where have you tasted the best dessert in the world? Oh my goodness. Okay, that's a difficult one. Um, I think it would have to be Paris. Yes? Ooh. Yes. Yeah. What, what did they, you have there um, that was that good? I had this really, I think it was um, like a meal fill. It had like caramel and mm. praline and hazelnut. Mm. Um, yeah, it was at one of the restaurants that I went for dinner. Wonderful oh, stuff. Yeah, it was really nice. But let's get into this okay. wonderful tiramisu we're about to make. So we're making the tiramisu cheesecake. Mm -hmm. um, Kat, so you can start off. Um, I have the syrup already made. Okay. So you're just going to dip the biscuits and then kind of make a ring around. Yes. And then I'm going to show Do you. Do I just give them a quick little yeah, dip? Yeah, yeah, just like a dip, just to moisten them. And that's okay. syrup. What yeah, does it consist of? Yeah, so the of? syrup has um, espresso, uh -huh. vanilla, and sugar. Espresso, like the coffee? Yes, oh. exactly, because tiramisu is like a coffee <laughs> dessert. Pick me up. But this uh, doesn't have no, any alcohol. espresso like the show. Uh, <laughs> yes, okay. espresso, okay. espresso. Okay. Okay. okay, all right. Okay, so in my saucepan, I'm going to start um, with the syrup. So mm -hmm. um, the syrup just basically has sugar, okay. um, so I'm vanilla. Need one, one of these. And then the espresso. Okay. So oh, this just goes. has to like kind of um, summer. Mm -hmm. So you can just just mix this. Yeah, up. yeah. You don't okay. have to like mix it all the time, but okay. just like just make sure that make the sugar sure that it dissolves. Stick. Yeah. I'm gonna pop exactly. more than one of these in here just so I can yeah. get this done. Okay. Quick. So I'm gonna make the filling. Um, it has mascarpone, cream cheese, mm. a little bit of espresso, sugar, and the melted cheddar. Okay. okay. So. What, what Faiza didn't tell me is that the initial part of getting this to actually stand up properly and stack them... Probably the trick. That's where the challenge <laughs> lies. Yeah. That's the tricky part. No, but it should because we'll it's there, moist, we'll so it should be fine. Okay. Ooh. Got some okay. biscuits falling over. So you so just keep going here with the with the stirring. That's yeah, yeah, you don't here. really need it. Just until the um, sugar dissolves. Okay, fine. okay. Oh, I'm terrible Are at you... this right now. I've got four of them, but they won't stand up. Um, okay, so what I suggest yes. um, in my recipe, what I did forget to tell you, um, you can just kind of trim the bases so that you. Have oh, the so curry. that they actually oh, do okay. stand yeah. up. Okay. <laughs> so Keys. I, yeah. <laughs> As you can see in that final finished product, they do yes, certainly have exactly. a bit more of a stable yes. base than the ones I have right yeah. now. Yeah. But what but I do love about your recipes is that they really are such an easy guide, oh. even for the most exactly. unadvanced so baker. So it's um, step by step, which yes, is really nice. Which is great. Um, uh, there are a few more challenging recipes, yeah. but most of the oh, recipes. I've lost some guys, <laughs> so I, I do need to go one at a time. That's, That's the, fine, yeah, they, because they I think they get quite, quite quickly. Uh, yeah, exactly. No, you must need lots of assistance in the kitchen to assemble a cake um, like that. Eh? Oh my goodness! Yeah. <laughs> you know what? At the, once I get enough of them, I just I need to get just, to a certain number. Yeah, just like uh, trim the bottoms, it will be fine. Okay, well, I'll need a knife for that. Well, how do we do that? Well, how yeah, do you yeah, do? with you a fork a, like this? Um, you need a knife. I'll yeah. get you one. I will get you one. Okay, so Mixing in the sugar with my mascarpone and the cream cheese. So you can use like an electric um, hand beater, but we're just going to use the whisk. Uh huh. And I'm going to add some vanilla. Good. Thank you, Uncle Tubbsy. Sure. Okay, so, so do you guys like baking? You said you like cooking. I, I'm more of, of a cook than, a, than I am a baker. I'm more of like the taster, really. Um, I just like taste everything. 
Okay. okay well, <laughs> I like sharing my. <laughs> Oh uh, my goodness. Maybe this do let us know on our Facebook, Express or Money Show SABC3. Uh, you know, your baking and your cooking. Are you more a baker? Are you more of a, 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 a cooking type person? But <laughs> a cooker, you, what were you about to say? A, a cooker. <laughs> <laughs> and if you are someone into baking, uh, what's your favorite dessert to bake to mark uh, any celebration? Uh, whether it's a birthday, whether it's a wedding, whatever it is. Uh, Question for you, Pfizer. Yes. Uh, you were talking about your, your love and your passion for, uh, for baking and how, you know, you kind of gone through many classes and you've developed it. Where did it all start? Um, so growing up, I didn't love baking. Um, I would prefer like playing outside, pranking the neighbors, that sort of thing. <laughs> Wait, what, 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 what was your best prank ever? Um, yeah, let's come, rather come, come. not no, no, say. No, 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 come, come. We're there now. Okay, I'm, so I'm we used to like so do can... these um, like roadblocks. Roadblocks? No, like, you know, like you put like boxes in the middle of the road, like on the street. <laughs> okay. Yeah, and then like hide behind. Yeah, we used to do that. Okay, kids, we, we don't play those games in 2020. <laughs> no. Yes. Far too dangerous. And either. then, um, yeah, that was just like on our street. And then we also, um, okay, so I would help my um, granny and my mom just bake for eat, but not like hardcore baking, just like cookies and things. Yeah. And then when I got married, um, I started experimenting with fondant cakes. Mm -hmm. So I would start baking for my sisters, birthdays and things like that. Oh, lovely. And then... Um, uh, with travel, I started um, experimenting with like French pastries. Lovely. Macarons. I became obsessed mm. with macarons. Tabzi, how are you doing there? Uh, yes, my Good. sauce is ready. Okay, so my pudding is done. Yeah, see, oh, it's goodness. much easier. Yeah, hey? no, yeah I, I would have been done by now, to be honest. Yeah, sorry. Mm. Uh, what, what's your favorite dessert to make for the family? Like a quick one if everyone's like, okay, we want dessert um, now. The trailesh. I have a really nice saffron trailesh in my recipe book. Uh -huh. um, so, yeah, that's is like... Trailesh. Yeah, it's... Three um, milks. Exactly. Very milky. It's also known as the milk cake. Um, it's very popular in um, the UAE, like oh, Dubai. Yeah. People oh, love, yeah, that. They love that. And you can flavor it with pistachio, nice. um, saffron. Mm -hmm. mm. So, hey, if you can't fly to Dubai, mm. to yes. make, Dubai. make a exactly. trailish. So, but. basically, it's just like a sponge cake, and then you flavor the cake with um, whatever you decide, like pistachio or nice. saffron or whatever. Nice. Mm -hmm. And then you make a three milk glaze with. Um, condensed milk, evaporated oh. milk, yes. and cream, and then you flavor that as well. And then you soak the sponge yeah. with that glaze, and then you also serve it on the side. Oh, nice. It's like melting your mouth. Oh, yeah, it's so, so that. decadent. Yeah. But let's talk about like wedding trends. Um, what, what's like the most trendy sort of wedding dessert thing that people are asking you to make okay, for so, them these um, days? I don't really uh, bake to sell, okay. um, so I just, we do like our classes, we teach oh, people how to make, but mm. the people attending our classes yes. do um, sell the pastries. To weddings, yes, exactly. parties and the works. Yeah. So I must say, um, there definitely is a trend for like smaller, like bite-sized pieces and okay. things like that, as opposed to like big uh, buffets with like big cakes and you know, mm. things like that. Um, right. So finger foods, um, but like desserts. Yeah, because people more popular. people don't finish the cake. People exactly. do make this huge like and I 10 think, tier like, cake. They want to taste everything. <laughs> yes. They don't want to like have a big piece. By the way, uh, at home, we are giving you the chance to win yourself a copy of this brand new book, My Sweet Life mm. by Pfizer Omar. You need to just get onto our Expresso Facebook page and let us know what would be your favorite flavor of wedding cake if you were to ask for one. I'm really hoping that I'll be able to get this done by the end of this uh, before we say goodbye because I've been working really hard and I want people to see the final product. Um, so but, when you're uh, done with that, I'm time. just going to put half of the filling in there and then we'll... Oh my goodness. Yeah, you're almost done. But almost. it seems Pressure. once you get the hang of it, yes, you really exactly. do move quicker. So basically, really well um, the part I forgot to tell Kat was that you really need to trim the bottom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So this is the part <laughs> that I would have yeah. yeah. started off with. But okay, suffice to say, we have enough. Uh, and it's uh, standing. Cookies. It's all yes, standing. It's exactly. all solid. Yeah, it's look at that. <laughs> well done. How about it? So well you can then, the filling yeah, in there. Yeah, so at home, um, then you'd also just line the base as well. Mm. Yes. Okay, but that's fine for today. We'll just. Um, in. I had, you know, I, I, I've got one additional one that didn't need to be there, but uh, yeah. So listen, get onto our Facebook page, answer that question, and who knows, you could be getting also, yourself a um, copy the of my speech. And also, the available on my website as well as yeah. in stores. We need to go, guys. In we the meantime, go, thank you very much. You finish so that off, and we'll thank see you again tomorrow, tomorrow morning, bright and early. Bye bye. Bye.